Tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. More than five years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. We go inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 34 wins, 10 losses, one draw, and two no contests. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Coconut Creek, Florida. Hector Lombard! And now we can see the opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. And we are underway. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one of the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Ooh, working well off of that trip. These guys are going at it here right away. Training runs. Beautiful knockout here early in the first. Yeah, we're just getting going, and now the fight's over, but excellent striking technique to land that shot and ultimately finish the fight here in the first. You've heard us say it before, but sometimes when you catch a guy cold before he's had a chance to get going in the fight, it can have a bigger effect. It certainly did here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. And here we see it again. Boom. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time.